In this video tutorial we're going to be looking at the iMovie user interface. The first thing I'm going to do is create a new project by going to File, New Project. Then I'm going to give it a name in this box here, something that I can remember and find easily in the future. The next option is to select the format or aspect ratio. I'm going to keep widescreen because I know I'll be using that. Next all I need to do is click Create. You can see that it's created a new project with the name that I specified. The next thing I'm going to do is to import some video clips. I do this by going to File, Import, Movies. And then I browse to the movies that I want. I think they're in this folder here. And then I'm going to select this one and uh, this one here, I think, and that one and one of these down here and another one maybe. Uh, this one here, yeah. Uh, the next option is to specify where these files will be saved to. Uh, next down is to add or create a new event. I always create a new event for my imports and I give that a sensible name that I'll remember. The next option can be left alone because I do want full quality. I then get an option down here for copying or moving the files and I keep copy and then I'll click insert. The video clips optimize and then import. And they generate some thumbnails. The videos then import down here into the event browser. Each clip is represented by a thumbnail. You'll also notice that I can move my mouse over the thumbnail and see what the contents are. This is also reflected in the preview window on the upper right. The next thing I want to do is select some video and put it into our project. I can do this by clicking on the clip. This automatically selects a four second section, but I can change this by dragging these handles on the left and right of the yellow box. When I'm happy with my selection, I can drag it up here into the project panel. So I'm going to select another clip now and drag that up to the first one. I think something like that will do. And then I'll drag that up and there we go, two clips. I've put another couple of clips in my project window here and I've shuffled them around a bit. What I'll do now is simply move my mouse to the far left of the first clip and press my spacebar to play through this simple edit. Each clip plays in turn from left to right. So there we have our completed simple edit in iMovie. Why don't you have a go?